morning, everyone. Uh, I'm here to tell you about Building IQ's predictive energy optimization system and how we save money in commercial buildings. Now, the, the build, commercial building owners face a host of, sorry, can't hear me? Face a host of um, market issues. Uh, first of which is the buildings uh, consume a lot of energy, actually about 20% of energy globally. In addition, energy prices and consumption in those buildings is going up. Um, and then, uh, not surprisingly, demand for energy performance uh, is being pushed on them by tenants, uh, government and government regulation, and investors in those property funds. Uh, unfortunately, the property sector is facing uh, the worst property slump, uh, the worst sector slump in decades, and so short of capital, earnings problems, etc. And this presents really a quandary around energy efficiency. Uh, energy efficiency initiatives are typically very capex intensive. They have long or uncertain payback periods. Um, they take skills, specialized skills and resources to implement, and there are typically split incentives between the owners who fund the initiatives and the tenants who, be who benefit. So really, this is the opportunity for Building IQ. We have created the first predictive energy optimization system. And what that means is, is uh, we basically make um, reduce energy significantly in, in buildings. We do it uh, in both new and existing buildings. And we do it by plugging into existing energy systems, leveraging that, and then optimizing how those systems run. Importantly, we're a software-only solution. So our solution does not require upfront capital. And we don't require any upgrades. Uh, our benefits are basically that we, we reduce energy, we reduce operating expenses, we improve property values, and increase energy performance. Our technology was developed initially by CSRO. We have a global exclusive license to the technology, as well as a strategic partnership with CSRO. And our team is really a mix of folks from the software controls and property industry. We've got 80 years of energy management and property experience on the team. Our execs have 20 years of startup experience. And we have an advisory group that includes the former CTO of Honeywell, as well as the senior green, green building advisor from Johnson Controls. Uh, lastly, we've got paid pilots in place in Australia and now expanding over to the US. So quick analogy to just show you how Building IQ works. Basically, the analogy is the autopilot system on a plane. Uh, certainly, it has an origin and destination, but then it looks at things inside the plane, the engine, fuel, et cetera and then external factors like weather, air traffic, things, and comes up with an optimized flight plan for the plane. And our system is really like an autopilot system for building energy. So we look at the existing control system in the building. We learn the building's thermal dynamics. We learn the capacity of the systems. And then we look at outside factors like weather, weather forecasts, energy prices, and smart grid signals. We take all that up uh, and we roll it up, put our algorithms over it, and come up with an optimized way to manage the building, optimizing cost, comfort, and emissions. So how are we different? Uh, certainly, there are a lot of energy systems out there. The key things that make us different are we automatically learn how the building operates. We forecast. We're always looking ahead. We're predictive. We forecast the day's energy use. We optimize to achieve certain outcomes with cost, emissions, and comfort. We're a software model. We sit on top of existing infrastructure, and we have a software business and delivery model. OK, just uh, here's a snapshot of live data, um, or actual data. The blue line is the, uh, the original profile of energy uh, across the day's use. The second is the building IQ profile. Uh, you can see here there's an optimized start on a cold morning that's dependent on both the particular building and the forecast for that day. We've managed to shave, shave a bunch of energy off in the morning. In the afternoon, when tariffs change from shoulder to peak prices, we managed to use less expensive energy rather than more expensive energy in the afternoon. We're now saving between 15 and 30% of building energy in our pilot buildings. A lot of detail here, but basically it's a multi-billion dollar market. Uh, we're very focused in terms of the specific segments we work through. Um, we have the potential, I guess, our addressable market is about $1.5 billion uh, in the US alone. Uh, in summary, multi-billion dollar global market with a real pain point, a very um, unique technology with strong value proposition, early demonstrated success in pilots, and a great team backed by industry-leading advisors and research. Thank you very much.